Domestic violence, it affects both young and old. It chooses no gender or ethnicity. I'm not going to bore you with statistics. Rather, I'd like to share my story. Body positioned on the cold, unforgiving pavement. My head is pounding from the powerful blow of reality. So this is what it feels like to hit rock bottom in a relationship. I hear footsteps in the distance. He ran away. I hear the radio blaring with static of codes and numbers. The call for backup, reassuring words. Help is on the way. Do not move. You are safe. Am I? My body trembling from the cold, unsympathetic confusion, the welt of animosity and affection. Motionless, I lay beneath the vibrant morning sky. Am I safe as I rest my head on Mother Earth? She understands all my fears. Do you know the perpetrator? How long do you live with him? Shamefully, my heart sinks, my tears boldly answer. I feel Solomon's overcoming my mental mind, incoherent. I'm loaded onto a gurney. The paramedic shakes my left arm and says, Stay awake. Pupils being tested, vitals taken. The remorse buried in the darkness of my head. My culpability of allowing this facade, my fairy tale romance. Flashbacks flow through my mind. Confounding emotions of both happy times and the times of bad. The sickening roller coaster I so willingly hopped on. No seatbelts, no rails, no safety net. I feel nauseated. I start to gag on what I thought was love. The ride in the ambulance, sirens blaring, calling out all that I have tucked away. I laugh at the thought. I am lucky. I only landed on my head. My name is Melissa. I am a survivor of domestic violence. One in four women will be a victim of domestic violence. We can't break the cycle of domestic violence by keeping it a secret. Remaining silent does more harm than good. Having a voice has helped me keep my perpetrator away. For more info, contact the National Domestic Violence at 1-800-799-SAFE. That is 1-800-799-SAFE. 7233. Those that inflict the scars forget. Those that wear them never forget.